Hello, it's Matt and welcome to Collaboration Coach. In this video, we're going to look at how to use quick edit view on your SharePoint lists. And just before we get started, if you like this video and you want to learn more about SharePoint, check out our SharePoint Champion course over at our school. The course has hours of video tutorials plus quizzes and how-to guides. You'll get 10% off when you buy the course and use the offer code YouTube. Check out the description for more details. So I'm in a SharePoint team site and I've got a list called stores. And you can see here, I've got four columns in my list. I've got the store, the revenue of the store, the manager and the location. So nice and simple. As with any list, I can manipulate these columns. So I can add new ones. I can make changes to the existing ones. And if I want to create new data, I can come to the new button and it will give me this call out on the right hand side here. And then I have to go through and add in new information. When I've saved that line of data, it will appear in my list. So what if you want to make changes to the list in bulk? So there's lots of things you want to do at the same time. Your best way to do that is to use the quick edit view. With every list, you're going to see this button up here called quick edit. And if I go into quick edit, you'll notice that the data changes from just a simple list to cells, a bit like a Excel spreadsheet. And I can click into these cells and make changes to the data. So for example, if I wanted to change the manager of the Kingston store to someone else, I could just remove the name, start typing the name of the new manager, and then it will look up the name from my address list and I can pick him. Now, the other thing you can do in quick edit view is copy values that you've already used. So for example, if I wanted to make Alex the manager of the bath store, I could come to the right here, just like in Excel, and you'll see my cursor turns to a plus, and I can click and hold and then drag, and it will copy that value Alex Wilbur down to the next cell. And I can do that all the way down if I wanted to. So there's a quick way of changing data in every cell. The other thing Quick Edit View supports is cell formatting. So for example, in here, I've got the revenue of 100,000. Now, if this Kingston saw was having a bad time and it dropped to 10,000, you can see the quick edit view can change the, the formatting of the cell based on the number I added, and it can do it in line. Another thing we can do in quick edit view is copy paste. So I can copy a whole line like this and do the copy just like a word with a control C or a command C. Then I can go down to the next line and control V or command V and that will add another line to my list. You can also add columns from quick view so I can go plus up here in the top and I can choose any of the columns and there's more column types there if I want so I just choose the column type I'm after. I'm going to call this area manager and now I'm going to add in Megan and I'm going to make her the area manager for all of these stores. I'm just going to change some of the data there. There you can see Quick Edit is an easy way of bulk editing your SharePoint lists. Thanks for watching and if you like this video then please check out our SharePoint Champion course over at our school at school.collaboration.coach.